new edition of 12 Tier Health that's coming up right after the break. Hey, Mountain Sky, you're watching News 12 New Jersey. Around New Jersey, around the clock. Welcome to 12 Tier Health. I'm Dr. Derek De Silva. People who deal with speech disorders like stuttering and stammering can end up suffering from low self-esteem and other behavioral problems. Joining us today to address those issues is speech educator Anna Dieter. Anna, welcome to the program. Thank you for having me. Hi. My pleasure. So, what is stuttering? Oh, you know what? May I tell you what stuttering is not? Okay. So, stuttering is not how conventional sources of information explain it. Stuttering is not neurological, it is not genetic, and it is not a medical condition that requires a cure. And uh, how do I know it? It's just stuttering is solved today. After 25 years of intensive research and uh, almost over 2,000 successful cases, a Russian scientist, Roman Snishko, solved stuttering. He was able to establish a baseline. Mm -hmm. He has uh, established what every naturally, normally speaking, human being does, what actions performs when he speaks, okay. naturally. And, and we'll be talking about that also, but do we know the causes? Do we know why this Yes, happens? of course. Causes are always the same, believe it or not, because what they say, they say there are so many causes, it's a mysterious neurological or even genetic condition. So there is one cause. It is always inappropriate use of a speaker of his own speech apparatus, speech mm -hmm. muscles. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we'll get into some of the treatments in another segment, but there, are, there seems to me to be very obvious psychological manifestations of this. What have you seen? Oh, I've seen so much. I've heard so many, I call it stuttering stories. Every student, and I have had already myself, over 30 successful, 100% successful cases again. And uh, stuttering, not many people know, but stuttering can be debilitating for a lifetime. Mm -hmm. No matter what a stuttering individual tries to do, stuttering is a constant reminder of his inadequacy to face any life challenges. Wow. The name of the book is Stuttering Solved. Anna Dieter is the author. Anna, thank you very much for joining us today. Thank you for having me again. My pleasure. Welcome to 12T Health. I'm Dr. Derek De Silva. Last week we talked about stuttering. It's a common speech disorder that affects millions of children and adults here in the U.S. We're continuing our discussion today with speech educator Anna Dieter. She's the author of the books Stuttering Salt. Anna, once again, thank you so much for joining us. Once again, thank you so much for having me. So, what is stuttering, just very quickly? Very quickly, basically. Stuttering is a simple lack of ability to speak correctly. It's basically a totally, completely healthy individual performs irrational actions and makes mistakes. His irrational actions are performed because of incorrect information that he has in his memory. So he believes that that's how he's supposed to do it. Now, we have a video that we're going to bring up, so just take a look at this, uh, folks, and watch this, oh. and then we'll, we'll come back okay. and comment on this. Just doesn't he think that it would take a bit? Got it. Well, because everything okay. he has to say has to be tr translated, and then it's been translated in a way that I understand. We've got a time machine and we've got an external hard drive, so what we'll do is we'll get all the important uh, files onto those before we bring it, just in case we have to reinstall. So what was the difference between the first video and the second video? The first video was uh, shot before the class, that's what we do, we just film on the, um, during the initial testing when a person did not know how to speak and the second part it was the video of a person, actually it was 
uh, in three and a half months after mm -hmm. the program. I have similar videos of a person, the same person speaking, uh, totally fine the same way on the third day of the class. He what knew how to speak. What do you do? What is your class? What is your teaching? It is a psychophysiological training, basically a program of self-education, self-speech education. I am just there to guide the person to make changes in his own speech behavior. That's it. Your book has a very interesting symbol on it. Just explain that to me and what we're looking at. This is just not about speech. It's about uh, a new paradigm in education. Everything we know and do today is because of what we learned ourselves. You see this question mark? Mm -hmm. That's how every learning begins. We ask ourselves a question and then we find ourselves the answer and we grow to the next level. It's the symbol of learning, symbol of knowledge. That's how our program is, what our program is based on and it says turn on your speech. So our students just have to turn their natural speech. I love it. On. I absolutely love it. Thank you so much. Great information. Once again, folks, Anna Dieter, she's the author of the book, Stuttering Salt. Great to have you with us. Thank you so much.